Meet the Moon Knight from the year 2846, and he looks badass as hell, and civilization is gone. He is what's left of the humanity inside of Earth. Even in this pathetic form and wrapped in bandages, the Khonshu God, or just the fist of the Khonshu, is still prevalent. These humans, this cult of Khonshu, worship me. In times of desperation, humans look for answers, for security. They cling to stuff in the past. For what this book is, this Moon Knight is basically training, trying to become the best Moon Knight possible. Getting his ass being the process, but also persevering. He wakes up from the simulation. Wake up! Recommend subject soul further 16 hours to return to acceptable bio levels. When this Moon Knight wakes up from his, I guess, matrix, this door starts cutting open to all these like predator looking things going kaka, ka, ka, ka. Soul, hear me. You, you are my fist, soul. I know, I know, Kanchu. Then hear this, soul. These hornets are not willing to worship me. They're not in the grasp of worshiping me. They need to be crushed. I'd be happy to, but I'm dying. And there's too many of them. It looks like these robot things, I guess, killed off all humanity because they said, you chased me to the end of the world. My last move was to lure you here where I have the home advantage. The only choice I have left is to let you take me out or I took you out with me. <laughs> Blows up this damn ass big spaceship look at the end from Halo straight up. Now he's on the surface of the moon and this is where he gets like a little amp from Kanchu. He picks up this big ass sword and goes, Chit, chit, chit. <laughs> takes them all out. I thought that was my end, but I was saved by the night. No, soul. You were reborn by the forever night. The one with no cycle, the one that lasts through internal darkness. It will sustain you for an eternity. This is Conchu. He looks different. I, I don't know what's going on here. Maybe this is like a, a potential future. Cool as shit, though.